welcome back to my channel so today's look is gonna be my Halloween costume and many others are out there trying to be a sexy kitten a sexy vampire a sexy something this year I decided to do something different why not I always dig Gene Simmons the whole kiss fan so might as well become one of them myself for today so if you're interested in how I did this whole Gene Simmons costume Keep on watching this video. <laughs> Let's get started. So first I'm going to pull up the photo of Gene Simmons. That way I know how to um, make the lines. And it's very simple. All it is I'm going to do is grab my black eyeliner and I'm going to um, do the design first and then I'm going to fill it in and the products that I'm going to be using today is just regular black eyeliner this one is from Maybelline Tattoo Studio and it's their blackest black and then the other two products is um, it's going to be Wet n Wild and then this is from their Halloween um, costume makeup it's the black one and then the white one so let's go ahead and um, start doing the outline of the actual um, picture of Gene Simmons so let's start with the actual star, star, um, I guess they're like stars or pointy things around his eyebrows. So he has a starting right here. So let me draw that. And then from here, from the nose, it goes up. And it doesn't have to be perfect. You just got, just want to make sure you get your outline. Alright, so let's go ahead and continue fill, um, filling in. Um, like for the sharp edges, the like the little spikes that are coming out of his face, you can go ahead and use continue with the black eyeliner because they're a little bit too um, skinny for the pencil to go in there. Not only that, you want this to be nice and sharp as well. Now let's go ahead and do the other side. So first, um, once you're done doing your outline, what I strongly recommend is go ahead and fill in your um, your waterline and then um, do like a like a thick eyeliner. That way you don't you know that way it doesn't show any skin. So go ahead and blacken up the waterline. Not even do it even underneath the. Um, underneath your eyelashes that way you don't struggle like that and then give yourself a nice eyeliner okay so then you go back in with your um with I call it like a pencil a thick pencil from the wet and wild Halloween makeup and just go ahead and fill in your eye You can fill in your eyebrows that way they're not peeking through. And then let's go ahead and get closer, like you're down in the bridge of the nose. Okay, so we're slowly gonna start bringing this in to this like, it was like a shark. Let me go back and sharpen up these um, edges. I and mean, then you can also go in with the white eyeliner. There's some little 
um, edges around these little sharp things that I didn't really go in there with the white makeup. So just a little white eyeliner to fill it in. Triangle. Let's draw in our lips. Just be careful you don't get the black into the white makeup because then next to you know start starting getting like different kinds of shades of gray. And you don't you don't want that. You can line your lips with the black eyeliner as well. Alright, so this is the finished look. Last but not least, let's just make sure um, our face is filled. This white is not sticking. Alright, last thing is I'm going to go ahead and set this makeup with my Urban Decay All Nighter. That way I can have this whole um, Gene Simmons look all day. So let's go ahead and spray ourselves. I don't know about you guys, but I really am digging this makeup. Uh, best costume ever so far. All right, so to finish off for the look, all I do is, it's just, do, all you can do is wear a black shirt with some black leggings, some black boots with some studs on them, and then a black leather jacket, and then some jewelry. And this is it. I wanna rock and roll all night and party every day. I wanna rock and roll all night.